and I challenge you to find a binder hotter than this one. <laughs> that I am on a mission to collect the entire pre-release stamp and world championship 2021 stamp leaders from Rome of the Gods. It actually took me a while to accomplish that mission but as you guys are seeing me today, I have something very exciting to share with you guys in my binder. This is just for fun but Kepla and I challenge you to find a binder hotter than this one. Well, when I finished constructing this binder, it completely blew my mind, although I only completed the first five pages. So let's go ahead. The first page. So it's like pretty much the standard, the signatures from Turning on the Power and Assaults of the Saiyans and two of my favorite secret rares, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta and Super Saiyan 4 Goku. And the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta is just here, so three of them matches. And Hide of Mastery, in my mind, is the secret rare of Colossal Warfare. So I made a slight twig to my next page, which you will see. Wow! On the left, I have my Vegeta God Rare. On the right, I have my Vegeta Secret Rare. They're both facing each other. And this Vegeta is accompanied by Mira and Kai. Unlike last time where I proxied Vegeta God Rare with the Vegeta Special Rare from Vermilion, this time I have the full set of 14 Special Rares, 3 Secret Rares, and a God Rare from Realm of the Gods. Doesn't this Vegeta look so amazing? I play them in the card <laughs> No negate! All of it. All of it. This by itself is like a piece of art that I would not trade anything for. So the next page is what I was on a mission for the past couple weeks to complete, and that is voila. So happy about it. So this page is filled with pre-release stamp leaders. I only don't have the Brewer because I really don't really like that card and I only needed nine of them. This page looks slightly different from this one because I graded some of the cards in here. So let's take a moment to admire this page. I'm gonna zoom in. <laughs> of all of the World Championship 2021 stamp leaders. This Crimson Warrior Vegeta is absolutely my favorite and I was pretty disappointed to know that he was not in one of the pre-release stamp leaders. I think this World Championship stamp is one of the best looking stamps that I've ever seen and all of the boilings in there just look so crazy. It is actually really insane to have them in one page. And it actually gives me motivation to work harder and strive harder in my career so I can complete my beautiful collection of the rarest cards in Dragon Ball Super card game in my binder. So when you look at this page, there's clearly some difference. And if you're wondering why Goku and Trunks and Vegeta are not in here, that's because I graded both of them in BGS 10 slabs. Well, I took the U7 Goku leader to the DBS card fest in Texas, and I'm still debating whether I still want to take Goku or take Vegeta and Trunks leader to my next in-person event, which is in San Diego. Both of them look really sick in this lab. I just have two more cards to share with you guys. One is this, I pulled it in one of my live streams with Joku. I'm wearing his jersey right now. It's actually really good looking and the quality is very good. But anyways, I pulled it with him, I graded it. Unfortunately, I got a 9.5. He graded his as well and he also got 9.5, so I guess it matches. <laughs> guess what's missing in this World Championship stamp collection? Nine liters over here, two in graded slabs. What is missing. Apex of Power. World Championship 2021 stamped Apex of Power in BGO slab. It got a 9.5, but I am still very, very happy. So I actually didn't get this World Stamp Apex myself. Donna graded it on Valentine's Day as my Valentine's gift. Yeah, it just returned recently, and I'm very happy about it because this PSA 10 regular Apex was my first ever Dragon Ball Super card that I got for myself. And this World Stamp Apex of Power is his 
this first ever Valentine's gift for me, so they match pretty well. Well, I'm very happy that I finished my World Stamp Leader collection so I can share it with you guys. And I'm very excited for my collector selection volume number two to get shipped here in a week or two so I can share it with you guys once it arrives. I hope you guys have fun today and thank you everyone for watching my video. I'll see you guys in my next video.